Hello, how are you today? Happy Saturday. As we wind out of week two into week three, I want to take some time to reflect with you about the concept of belonging. Belonging is at the core of humanizing. And this week we dug deeper into the concept of cultural mismatches when you reflected a bit on your cultural context inventories. And thank you for doing that. I hope that was a valuable experience for you. When we think about the concept of belonging, we want to keep in mind that belonging is different from fitting in. Belonging is when a person is accepted and valued for their true authentic self. Fitting in feels very differently. And it's that fitting in that we want to mitigate, that we want to improve. And when you're teaching an online class, you have this high opportunity zone, which is week zero through two, where there's a lot of threat and a lot of scanning that a person does to determine whether or not an environment is safe. So the elements that you de develop in the academy will help you to create that place where students feel identity safety. That's something that you've been digging into already. In module two, in addition to the reflections and the discussion that you had about the power of partnerships, you also got started with honing in on some basic and critical video skills. And you're creating the first draft of your liquid syllabus. You're gonna create three of those drafts, so think of it as an ongoing iterative process. Um, and we hope you enjoy that. These elements, the liquid syllabus, the course card, the humanized homepage, these are all elements that will target that high opportunity zone. So keep that in mind and think about how you can hone your goal of creating identity safety and building trust through these incremental marbles in a jar by developing inclusive materials using words, images, and videos. I'm actually recording this video from the elementary school where my kids went to school. I walked out my front door and I thought, where should I record from today? And I looked at the school and I thought, that's it. Because that is really a formative uh, symbol for when my kids really started to struggle and figure out where they fit in or if they belonged. Um, and I know that I'm coming into this and my kids are coming into this from a privileged place. Uh, with many privileges, including the color of our skin, but many others as well. Um, and so I want to acknowledge that. But I think the more we can reflect on our own experiences, it really does help us to make these intimate connections with the topic of belonging and help us really lean into our hard, hard work, our equity journey, which is not going to end at the end of six weeks. It's going to continue. So as we make this shift and start to wrap up uh, module two and lean into module three, you are going to be looking forward and continuing to build on not only the tools that you'll be using, but also really fostering those humanizing elements, developing them further. You'll work more on your liquid syllabus and actually engage in a peer review of that liquid syllabus that'll happen next weekend at the end of module three. Well, the lawn mowers are getting louder, so I think I'm going to wrap it up for now. You have a great weekend, folks, and I'll see you online.